Now, one of the lawmakers who voted to object to Pennsylvania's electors is Congressman Rob Whitman. The Republican lawmaker represents Virginia's first district, which includes the Middle Peninsula and Northern Neck. He told our Erica Greenway today that he condemns the violence but stands by his decision to object. And this is not about overturning the, the election. It's about making sure that folks that have concerns about our election processes have their concerns expressed. I wanted to make sure that we had the debate. You know, the, the, the effort to object is a procedural one. The objection is to make sure we have the debate to be able to bring that state up and talk about the issues surrounding that. Uh, the, the debate happened with Arizona. And listen, I didn't think the issues with Arizona from a constitutional basis, and that's how I looked at these, these issues from a constitutional viewpoint. I didn't think the issues with Arizona rose to the point of, of voting uh, to, to object to those electors. Uh, in Pennsylvania, though, uh, there were issues there, and I think significant issues, ones that I just don't think that we could look past. So do you now support Biden as president, or do you feel like President Trump was robbed of the election? Uh, listen, no, uh, Joe Biden is our president. Uh, the Electoral College votes have been counted. Uh, they have been certified. Joe Biden is president-elect. Kamala Harris is vice president-elect. Now, Congressman Whitman also said while he is glad President Trump said there will be a peaceful transition of power, he does feel the president needs to do more to settle emotions.